people and welcome back to another video. Now as you can see I'm playing one of my fair that's right, one of my favourite games. Universe Sandbox, the only game where you can get a smash into another earth and kill everyone on it. Okay. I need to really slow this down. Full cycle every okay now it's the full cycle every like twelve seconds. I don't know if I could change it to yeah yeah seconds per second one so this be real time very slow but gonna see that be like if you smashed a uh, in universe sandbox of course with just a random asteroid that happened to be coming right into Earth. All the people who live in Indonesia and Indonesia, China. I think it would still affect Russia and Japan a tiny bit. So that, that would actually be quite deadly like look so even though it's tiny it's only 20 no that's that's massive for an asteroid Yeah, like, with that weight, that could really do some damage. That's massive for an asteroid as well. But as you can see, it's almost curved. But in real life, I think the asteroid that wiped out the dinosaurs from about that size are a bit uh, smaller. So, its speed... I'm just going to settle it at... 30, no, no, not two, 30 kilometers per second. So, I think it's, like, if this came, like, that area would pretty much be doomed. Because it's slowly speeding up. I guess that's realistic, because as it gets closer to the Earth, the gravity kind of affects it, and in real life, because of how gravity works, it's as it comes in, because it's guaranteed to land pretty much about there, but the earth will also move, but this is obviously speeding up. In real life, if it got caught in the orbit, that would speed it up, and if it was in the right orbit, it would then hit, I guess, somewhere on this side in Africa and Russia and all Europe. So, I guess that could happen, but I don't think the game is that realistic, so... Still slowly speeding up. Just... Help... Oh, no, no, no. That is speeding up very quickly. Uh, yep. Imagine if an asteroid came this fast and it, like it wasn't slowing down as well. It was really speeding up. I would be worried. Honestly. Like imagine. Like on the news you hear this asteroid, it's about to reach a kilometre a second of speed and it's guessed to hit right in, right in Earth. I think in real life, if, the, if we were lucky, it would get pulled by the uh, rotation, I don't know, uh, orbit and then just be flung round. Pretty much like a gravity assist, honestly. 
Whatever they're called, I don't know, but that's what would happen. So, as it's speeding up, imagine if the scientists came and they're like, oh yeah, oh, oh, that, that bend in it, like just as it starts speeding up a lot more. Yeah, if it came this fast to Earth, scientists would probably be telling people to get out there quick. Unless this happened. Or is it going to be affected by the orbit? Wait, it really missed that badly. Wait, let me check how it went. Look, it was... Oh... So, that was kind of a mistake on me, but imagine if that actually did happen. So, okay, what should I hit? Random asteroid, I guess. That looks pretty big. Not as big as that one, but... But, that's bigger. So... Pull up the menu. Uh, what's happened? Please let me pull up the menu. Yeah, I I don't know what's happened there, <laughs> but some motion. Yeah, the speed it's already really speeding up. Like, like look, this is a meters per second. But do I just bump that up and? Oh, okay. How much is that missed by? Why do I keep missing, honestly? Oh, I think I know why. The Earth is going this way. The asteroids I'm doing are going... I think if I do this, it's pretty much guaranteed to hit into us. That one looks very big. 36 kilometers. They just keep getting bigger each time. Just let me... Yes. Yeah. People of Japan and Russia and China, you might want to get out quick. Is it not going to be fun? Chup. 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 Boop. Boop. Is this hits into the air. Should hit the Oh. Oh no, that was a grazing shot. Accident, like, I, I, when I try to do a grazing shot, it never works. Like, in real life, a grazing shot, pretty much, it loses a lot of its mass because a lot of it's pulled off. And also, the planet that the grazing shot is done on also loses a lot of mass because it's just hit through it, pretty much. I need to really speed this up. Oh no! I think it just blew up just a very a lot of heat. Okay, so this looks like a load of gas molecules, or well, very big molecules. Eat, eat, eat goes off, I guess. And a lot of these fragments. Like, that is deadly. They're really hot first. But it's... Because... Look. You can see it. No, I just... But it's so light that if you were on... Because, look. It looks like that. So, if you were on Jupiter, 
if it was coming for you as well, so it's like going down pretty much, you'd have to go. That, you'd be scared because, like, you can see it from the surface of Jupiter perfectly. And I feel like, in real life, I feel like Mars would be badly damaged for multiple reasons. First, um, the, ex the heat of the explosion would definitely get to it, like, with that much. And also, it would just create a lot of heat anyway, because, again, you can see it like it's next to you from Mars. Okay, now the fragments are starting to cool down, so then, so it's not going to look like they're right next to it, it's more going to look like uh, a little hot thing, really. But, like, imagine that happened in real life. Like, now it's just, like, you can't notice it unless, like, I guess you could notice it if you far out, because it would look really, but a lot, some of these, no, no, I think the radius of this fragment is still going up, and it's twice. I know it's not a fragment, but it's a, it's made of, yes, yeah, made of iron and silica. Whatever is here that I'm selected on, I, I guess it's just a lot of, I guess, uh, I, I guess it would technically have to be, <laughs> What if I just turned one of these fragments into pure hydrogen water? Why aren't you letting me edit it? Why aren't you letting me edit it? Now, what I do want to see is what happens you just put loads of water into the sun, because wouldn't you expect it to cool it? But, okay, now it's 100% water, but I think it needs to be more 50. Oh, that's strange. No, it won't. It doesn't want to split it 50-50. Oh, oh. Ooh, I think I need to do it with this material. So each particle will be the size of Jupiter. Going just at, just at double the speed of light, you know. Won't do that much. Hmm, I think I need to so object a second. Okay. I guess it's the mass of this. One sun is every particle of water. That's what would happen, I guess. Supernova, but now it's balancing out, but not balancing out, it's really, I don't know how, that's how water turns into hydrogen, but would there be like huge amounts of oxygen as well, if there was something to convert the water into, I guess there would have to be huge amounts of oxygen as well, on this blue thing, it looks like goo. Looks like one of those fake games, like you know those fake games where they in the adverts they say it's proper slime, but really it's just the adverts trying to make it look cool so they can make a bit of money. I wonder what happens if you just bombard the sun with hydrogen instead? Does it just grow even more? Oopsie! Uh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There? 
Ah, uh, that hurts my head. It's just everything here just gonna come in to it, the black hole. Hurts my head, hurts my head, hurts my head. Oh, look at it, look at it. I'm gonna feed the black hole. A full Milky Way of two Milky Ways, three Milky Ways, random amount of number Milky Ways. Okay, <laughs> I have no idea what I've done. I'm just turned the sun into a black hole, and it hurts my eyes when I zoom out. But. God, imagine if that happened. Is this gonna be the Milky Way, like here? Here, no water, I have an idea. I thought something cool. You know, something real cool. Collisions. You know, just something that makes you want to go, yes! Slow motion. Ah, oh, yes. Look at that. So cool. When you just live on this side of the world, in, in Indonesia, you're like, hmm, I wonder why it feels a bit hotter today. Oh, why does it feel like the other side of the world is collapsing and the gravitational forces are changing because of the extra weight and the moon is gone so the tides are gone hmm i wonder why um i don't know what could possibly do that but oh no it's happening and then and then the people in indonesia are like why is there giant red like the kids are like why is there giant red flags coming right for us the parents are like Ugh. Gotta go to Mars. Yeah. You know, like, imagine this actually happened. Well, these, these people get a nice view. I don't know. Can I actually call the up? Um, now it's my favourite time. Time when all the fragments hit in. Okay, I need to cool the earth. Because the earth is so cool, I need to cool it even more. Haha, <laughs> get it? Oh, so funny. Okay. <laughs> Total power. Negative four gigawatts. G oh. I thought this was negative four gigawatts or gigawatts. Whatever it's uh, I don't really care. I want to destroy the earth anyway. Hmm. Power per area. Just bump that up a bit. Uh, hmm. It just doesn't feel big enough. You know what? If anything doesn't feel big enough, I just make it the size of the moon. That's what you men do. Now, both sides of the world have pretty much been attacked by the moon. <laughs> this side has just been attacked by a laser the size of the moon. Ooh, I'm drawing a big smiley face. This is the nose. Nah, nah, that'll be the eye. 
This is just the best way to draw smiley faces. Okay. This is the mouth. Yeah, I feel bad for this <laughs> Okay, now. I need to turn the radius down a bit to 0 0.25 for the unibrow, of course. And uh, I just, because I, I think it can't really do eyebrows. Or can I? Oh, it's there. Well, the only reason I was doing the unibrow is because I can't really do eyebrows. But now I've made it a bit shorter, I can. And now the hair. Yes, this is gonna be like this is gonna get on trending if I make this my thumbnail. <laughs> this is just such a special moment that I need to do that thing that I used to be able to know how, but now I don't. I think it must be in settings. Yeah, I do turn the audio down, because... Okay. I think that... Uh, where is it where you can... Yeah. Now I just need to take a screenshot of this. Okay. Okay, I've got my screenshot. That is just beautiful. <laughs> why, why did I do this? Oh yes, because I thought that it would be an entertaining video to just do some more universe unbox. We haven't uploaded. But should, does he look angry or happy? I. I can't really tell the difference with this guy. He just doesn't look right. Okay, do you think this guy looks happy or angry? Say one in the comments if you think he looks happy. Say two if you think he looks mad or whatever I said. I, I don't think he looks that bad, but it just needs a help. Bye, guys. <laughs> hope you enjoyed today's video. I enjoyed making it. I hope you enjoyed watching it, too. Bye. Bye, peeps.